Hmm, that's a perfect place to store it. Let me see something. No, you're too big. I'm gonna ride with my road dog. HP 12 from Bridge City. I love this hand plane. It's very nice and heavy. Love the aesthetics of it. Bridge City likes to market themselves as the Rolex of woodworking tools. So here you have the mouth that you could adjust. Let's see if I get closer. Then you have the blade retention here, which is a easy snap off, snap on. And the blade here, let's take it out like that. You also have the blade guard, because you have two blades to help from hitting the other side. It comes at a 25 and a 30 degree angle. Then you have the micro, bev micro bevel there. So the only thing I have about this is how to put the blade back. I guess that way. Then you have the blade adjustment here. back all the way and it has a nice grip to it it's easy to plane so I never owned a hand plane or really got into it as far as it's not needed but I did come into some projects where this will come in handy and I've been waiting to purchase the right one and I decided to go with Bridge City So this tool also comes with depth skits, where you could just put it here on the side, and then you could just level it to the measurement you want and be able to plane your wood to the dimension you want. It's a nice tool to have. Don't think I will use it. But it comes in, probably comes in handy one day. Nice. Just love the aesthetics of this. I think this might just sit on my shelf just to look at it. Don't want to abuse it yet. So next is the youngest, the toughest little brother of the HP-12, which is this one, the HP-9. Similar design, the smaller, you can see the size difference between them both. So I like how this one was designed also. You have the blade retention here. Retract it, snap on, snap off. Then the blade, which is the same 25 degrees and 30 degrees and it also includes the blade guard. And the same thing with this one is putting the blade back. Yes, that works. And you just snap it on. You have the same mouth to adjust. And the blade adjustment here. Love the aesthetics of this one. Just looks so nice. 
I don't want to abuse it yet. So next, we have the mini block plane, which is the celebration edition. I couldn't choose out of the colors, so I decided just to purchase all three. Let me pull it back more so the camera can see. I would say my favorite out of all this is the sapphire blue. So the difference, you have the original mini block plane, which is this one. This is lightweight, it's like about a half a pound. And then you have this one, it's almost a pound. I think about 15 ounces. So the difference between both is that you have, let me put these up here. So this one is made out of aircraft aluminum, very lightweight. But this one here, you have the skids that is titanium, and then the body is stainless steel. The same thing, you could adjust the mouth. Let's see if I could, it's kind of tight. There we go. And I love how the inside here, same color. They took a lot of thought into this. And then last but not least, you have this one, which comes with a chopstick master, which is the depth skids is plastic because you have to keep on going back and forth. But there you have it. And I forgot to mention, so the HP9 does come with an extra It also includes the depth skit, same concept. You want to plane down to a certain depth, just insert the screws there. But this one that amazed me is, you have this here. So this, let me put it in this way first. So you insert, here, and then you attach this, depending on how you want to. This help guides, you want to give a 45 degree chamfered or, I think I'm loosening it. All right, there we go. So you can tighten it up this way. And if you want to give a 45 degree chamfer on the edges, this will help you guide, which I think is a good tool. It's very nice. Let me loosen this one up first. And don't forget when you purchase the hand plane to purchase the honing guide. This bad boy here to get precise honing. Then it comes with the gauge here, the 25 degree, 30 degrees, 20 and 35. So there you have it. A quick unboxing and overview of the hand planes.